how to fix OBS Studio encoding overloaded problem. There are several factors that can cause this particular problem ranging from low storage to a CPU bottleneck. In this latest video installment of our troubleshooting series, we will tackle the OBS Studio encoding overloaded issue. But before performing any of the recommended troubleshooting steps, it's best to restart your computer first. This action refreshes the operating system and remove any corrupt temporary data that could be causing the problem. First, try reducing the output resolution. If the CPU is having difficulties keeping up with the high resolution encoding then this issue can occur. To fix this, you will have to reduce the output resolution. To do this, launch OBS Studio. Then at the bottom right corner, click on Settings and the Settings window opens. Then click on Video Category at the left pane. At the Output Scaled Resolution category, try to lower your resolution. If it is set to 1920 by 1080 you can try to reduce it to 720. In here the output is 1920 by 1080 so we are going to reduce it to 1280 by 720 by choosing at the drop-down menu. Then click Apply to apply changes made. Then click OK to exit Settings section. Then exit OBS Studio. Next restart your computer. After computer completely reboots check if the OBS Studio encoding overloaded issue still occurs. Next try lowering the frame rate. To do this, launch OBS Studio. Then at the bottom right corner click on Settings the Settings window opens. Then click on Video category at the left pane. Then at the Common FPS Values category, click on the drop-down menu and select a lower value. If it was 30 you can consider going to 20. Then click Apply to apply changes made. Then click OK to exit Settings section. Then exit OBS Studio. Next restart your computer. After computer completely reboots, check if the OBS Studio encoding overloaded issue still occurs. Next change X264 preset. By default the X264 encoder is being used and the preset is set to very fast try changing the setting then check if the issue still occurs. To do this, launch OBS Studio. Then at the bottom right corner click on Settings, the Settings window opens. Then click on Output category at the left pane. Then at the Streaming category on the right pane click on Enable Advanced Encoder Settings. Click on Encoder Preset drop-down menu try changing the preset modes and see if selecting any faster one solves the issue for you. Then click Apply to apply changes made. Then click OK to exit Settings section. Then exit OBS Studio. Next check if the OBS Studio encoding overloaded issue still occurs. Next try using hardware encoding. To do this, launch OBS Studio. Then at the bottom right corner click on Settings. The settings window opens, then click on output category at the left pane. Then under the streaming section click on encoder to expand its drop-down menu. 
From the drop-down menu select the option NVENCH 264. This will enable hardware encoding on your NVIDIA graphics card. Then click Apply to apply changes made. Then click OK to exit settings section. Then exit OBS Studio. Next check if the OBS Studio encoding overloaded issue still occurs. Next free up disk space. If your disk drive does not have sufficient space to store the streamed content then this problem can occur. You can try freeing up disk space by using the disk cleanup tool. To do this press Windows plus C to open the file explorer, then click on this PC. Then select the drive which you want to clean. Right click on it and select properties from the drop down menu. At the properties section select the general tab. Then click disk cleanup tab, a new window opens. In here you will see the total amount of disk space that you can gain after you will do the disk cleanup. Then click on cleanup system files. Disk cleanup will now begin. At the disk cleanup window you will be given a list of files to delete for the total amount of disk space to gain. Click OK to confirm. A prompt message appears if you are sure to permanently delete the files. Click Delete Files. After cleaning the disk restart your computer. Make sure that you have at least 5 to 10 GB space free on your drive. Restart your computer. After computer completely reboots check if the OBS Studio encoding overloaded issue still occurs. Lastly, close programs running in the background. In case the mentioned steps fails to fix the problem then you should close the programs running in the background as this will use a considerable amount of CPU resources. To do this, right-click on Start or Windows button, then click on Task Manager to open it. In the Task Manager select any extra applications running in the background, right-click on them and select End Task. If you find any which are constantly running and consuming CPU, right-click on them and select End Task. Then exit Task Manager window. Next check if the OBS Studio encoding overloaded issue still occurs. After following the methods mentioned you have successfully fixed OBS Studio encoding overloaded issue. I hope that this guide has been helpful please support us by clicking like, share, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more troubleshooting videos.